Are we back? All right, you guys, we're back. We're going to finish Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, and Aquarius, Libra, and Gemini. Step in now. We're finding your vibe. Open sesame, here comes Rastama. Abracadabra, catch me if you can. I know you find it hard to believe that the genie of the lamp do anything you wish, but right now. Hey! Okay, that's it with that, you guys. All right, so let's get started with, uh, I'm going to play a stepping out. I know you find it hard to believe that I am the genie of the lamp and I can do anything you wish, but right now. Uh, let me see. Karaoke for still pause. I think I'm gonna play. Um, yeah, this is karaoke. Yeah, this is karaoke. I think I can play this. Okay, um, Virgo, let's see what your uh, refining your vibe card. Somebody got their ass with. Mm hmm. Somebody got their ass with. Somebody got they ass what? Yes. Somebody giving out calling cards, baby. Okay, Virgo. Okay, you was bold about something. <laughs> you was bold about something, Virgo. Refining your vibe. Okay, on my board. I'm sorry, let me explain. Because we back. Create a position of strength. self created demons. What your vibe is, what you die with. Meditation, fasting, okay, what you vibe with, okay, develop skills of inner strength and analyze the way you move, letting emotional scars influence a current relationship, unresolved grief, okay, you're insane right now, you got some insane energy, the nut doesn't reveal the tree, it contains, <laughs> I like that. The nut doesn't reveal the tree it contains. Call on all the tickets. Limited belief. A big for cigarette and a fancy car. You think he's a superstar. Life, life without music. I don't want no, no. Life without music, I can't go on, no. I'm gonna get it. It's the last thing I do. That's your energy, Virgo. Okay. <laughs> okay. Limited belief attracting roadblocks. Your core beliefs lie in your subconscious and align with your uh, match your frequency. Beliefs empower. Belief systems can empower you or dispower you. What vibration are you sending out? Look deeper, Virgo. Okay. You need to look and see what kind of uh, vibration you're sending out, Virgo. Okay. So you need some self-introspection. Okay. All right. That will create a position of strength in your journey. Because something is making you insane. Whatever these emotional scars from the past, it's making you insane. Whatever this unresolved grief in your energy is a spiritual block. And you cannot create a position of strength. It's self-created demon. You need to observe the obvious in silence, my friend. Okay. Because your vibe is taking a dive. All right. Okay, says the nut doesn't reveal the tree. It, it, the nut doesn't reveal the tree it contains, right? Okay, you were bold in something, my friend. You took action. You feel like a fool. Okay, you need to refine your vibe. This is a spiritual block. Whatever it was, you feel like a fool. Okay, so the nut doesn't reveal the the tree it contains. So either. This can go different energies. If you thought somebody was a nut, 
and it, it, it contained a whole tree and you didn't know about, right? You was a fool because of your, your limited belief system. You attracted a roadblock and now you're in a vicious cycle, right? Going back to people from the past, vicious cycle, right? It says be weary being with somebody from the past. People who have already hurt you, Virgo. Okay? So you can't create a position of strength on your journey. You need to observe the obvious in silence. This is self-defeating behavior, right? Self-introspection is needed, right? Some self-evaluation. So if you do some self-direct correcting, that's going to lead you into some self-reflection, right? Energy. Okay? Then you go into self-discovery, right? Self-reliance, right? Self-empowerment means you know your weakness and strength. And then you move into self-healing, right? Okay. And that's where we start the soul building work and the soul healing work at that point. Okay. That's just my system. Right. Okay. All right, Virgo. We'll do one more. Right now, you, you've been in a vicious cycle. Vicious cycle. Vicious. Okay. You keep going. You keep going back to people from your past. That's why you are insane. When you continue to do anything with cycle, anything you keep redoing over and over and over again, anything you keep talking about over and over and over again, fact check, you're insane, okay? And now you feel like a fool, okay? Because you was on this who I am block, right? So maybe you didn't want to let this vicious person or vicious cycle go because this person was a who I am. Meaning somebody had money, education, so they didn't want to let it go because they felt it created a position of strength for their life. They felt they was following their heart, right? Looking good in front of everybody, right? But actually, it was nothing but a vicious cycle. Okay. One more bird. It was actually a vicious cycle. Okay. Okay, now you're scared to be a... Uh, uh, you're scared of being criticized. That's your fear. You're scared of being criticized about this situation because you was told, because you knew. The energy I'm picking up, this is decades of BS. Decades, Virgo. Decades, decades. And so that's why you feel like a full decades. Vicious cycle. Okay? Vibration, sound. All life has a frequency and sound. Whatever you speak has a vibrational energetic. It's time to be more conscious of your words. Okay, remember your words are your currency, your thoughts are your currency. Choosing to surround yourself with a daily, okay, daily, daily. So for your energy, the re you need to refine your vibe, okay, because you got insanity in your energy right now, okay, you in a vicious cycle, you, you're, being, you're being afraid of being criticized, your vibration is vicious cycle, okay, you need to do some uh, Self-analyzation work. You need some self-introspection work. This is self-destruction. You need to be self-determined and self-balancing yourself, okay? Shine light onto your pain, my friend, right? You need to put on battle warrior prayer. Deny your flesh, right? Fast and keep you lasting, okay? Because your vibe is taking a dive, Virgo, all right? Refine it. It's not hard to refine your vibe, okay? Let's go to Capricorn. See what we have for cap. Let's see what we have for cap. Yeah, I gotta get ready. Uh, let's start doing phone calls. Okay. Cap. Okay, cap. Father wants you to read John 10, chapter 10, 10. Capricorn. Okay, let me see what John 10, 10 says. It's 111. Let me see. I think I remember, but I want to make sure. John, um, John chapter 10, verse 10. According okay. to Bible Ref, John chapter 10, verse 10, KJV. The thief cometh not, but for to steal, and to kill, and to destroy. I am come that they might have life, and that they might have it more abundantly. Okay. The thief only comes, the thief comes only to steal and kill and destroy. So Capricorn, Father wants you to read that scripture. Okay. Move forward. Resurrect the situation. Past skeletons. You have an inability to move forward. Okay. Okay. And Capricorns do. You guys stay in the past. 
backlash, right? Okay. So listen, the um the phone call I had was my karmic male. Like I said, we have six kids together. We've been done for a decade and probably uh, years, right? He's a cat. He's still holding on to what? I have no idea. That's your business. But I know something's going on because I know for a fact I signed those child support papers and I gave it back to the caseworker. So what he's talking about, no, 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 no. Okay. So wait, so... Uh, when I turned the camera off, I went and called my son and said, where well, your dad at? And handled the phone. So my son said, oh, he don't want to talk to you. See, people expect for the way they feel about you to be effective. I don't give a shit. That's your problem. I'm not going to call you to talk to you about your money. It's not my problem. You can sit my baby's back. That's what you can do. Negro, that's what you can do because I know you watch my video. You can send my you can send my babies back. That's what you can do. <laughs> that's why we're receiving this backlash. But remember, I just told you guys that he tried to tell them I was fraud and, and keeping the kids. See, Capricorn backlash, homie. Backlash. Trying to resurrect the old situation and past skeletons. You feel me? Yeah. Right? Uh. Reading sound like it's for you. Oh, boy, yeah. Now you're getting a backlash. Told you. Leave me alone. Don't bother you. What's your problem? Yeah. What's your problem? I know what your problem is. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you're afraid your worst nightmare is going to come true, huh? <laughs> ah! You're afraid your worst nightmare is going to come true, huh? You thought you put all kind of things up in that pot, right, baby? <laughs> Yeah, father said plot twist. Plot twist, baby. In the mist, there sure is a plot twist. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Okay, anyway, Capricorn. Let's see. Yeah, sound like, yeah, look, you need to realign because you're getting some black lash. Trying to get me caught up on some fraudulent stuff. Yeah. We agreed that you're going to pay that, that back child support. That was only like $500. You already agreed to that. So what's the problem? Now you want to go back and forth. Revenge. See, look. Cap won't revenge. Now, if you're supposed to be getting married, you're supposed to be all up in love, what you all up in my business still for? And worry about what the heck I'm doing. You need to repair your own energy. I told you I had three karmic males. Three karmic. I had a cousin. Mm-hmm. My kid's father. Mm-hmm. And my spiritual connect. Yep. Now you're trying to self-justify something because stuff is coming out. My, my kid's father tried to have me killed. Yeah, he did. Yeah, he did. Yeah, he did. I heard the whole conversation on the phone with the coast dude. I, I heard it. They, I heard it, right? What you vibe is what you die with, right? Stop watching. Somebody's watching now. Somebody's worried now. Yeah, I know you are. I'm pretty sure you are. Okay. I'm pretty sure you are. Yeah, y'all didn't think this was going to come back. It's been, what, 10 years? You didn't think it was going to come back. That's why I say on my journey, I thank my father. I can't believe I'm supposed to be sitting here to this day. He protecting me, honey. I ain't going to, uh-uh. So whatever he want me to do, I'm going to do. Without question. You become aware of unresolved issues like guilt, shame, and hurt, and anger, and unforgiveness. Okay, so, yeah, you feeling guilty and ashamed. Yeah, you is. You ain't about to project them, them, that, that energy on me. Okay? You trying to tr justify your bad behavior, cat? Yeah. Tr trying to justify your baby, bad behavior came out twice. So you need to refine your vibe. Okay? This is very self-feeding behavior. Uh, you have some unresolved issues, transformation. Ask yourself a question. Time to let go, cat. Expect some sort of ending. What have you had enough of? Embrace the change. Follow the process. <laughs> Something is dissolving, and it's time for prayer and silence. And I'm going to leave you that. Refining your vibe, Capricorn, okay? Refining your vibe. Yeah, this sounds like a lot like my, uh, my kid's father. Self-introspection is needed, okay? Analyze the way you move, right? Some self-direct correcting. Self-direct self correcting will lead you into self-reflection, right? Self-reflection can lead you into either self-discovery or self-awareness, right? 
self-reliance, right? Okay, self-empowerment, self-improvement, knowing your weakness and your strength so your body won't take a dive, right? Okay, and once you get to that soul, that soul healing, self-healing, right? Now you're going to be soul building, right? Okay, it leads you to soul healing, right? And you create a position of strength on your spiritual journey so your body won't take a dive. Okay, Cap? Bottles up. All right, baby. There you go. Yeah, you're getting some backlash. You got some revenge going on. You need to realign yourself. You're watching and worried about something, wishing for something. Yeah, you're getting some backlash. Backslash me. Boomerang effect, babe. You didn't did something. Yep. Yeah. And it's an old situation. Yeah, very old. Ancient old. Yeah, very ancient old, baby. Ancient. Oh! Oh, I can't wait to get home and watch The Covenant. Honey, I'll be on my little uh, movies. Ooh wee Have a good time. Okay, uh, Taurus. Let's see what's up with the Taurus. Okay. Okay, that just that just fell out. Look, stop looking outside yourself for validation, right? Willing to embrace your change, Taurus, right? I know a Taurus right now, yeah. That's on YouTube. Stop looking outside yourself for validation. Yeah. That annoys me with my older women that do that. I don't understand. Yeah, you're looking for outside, yeah, for validation. Create a position of strength for yourself. That's a spiritual block on your journey, okay? Yeah, your vibe is taking a dive. You need to observe the obvious in silence. That's a self-created demon. Looking for validation outside yourself. Yeah, uh-huh. Yeah, I got some tourists that are tripping right now. Yeah, yeah, y'all y'all own one. Hard accomplished. Stay conscious, right? Your spiritual lessons continue to unfold before, before you by being aware of your thought patterns. Although it's very challenging, the point is to every challenge to find the hidden treasure and reflect. That's a pop tip. Okay. Gratitude and compassion is the highest frequency. I'm going to give y'all something. Just like these masculine. It takes time to build up to that, to the compassion and gratitude of your journey. Right. Right. If you guys keep staying in this energy field where y'all hate him and he ain't this and he ain't that and da 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 da, I hate saying da 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 da. Let's 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 speak English here. If you keep talking about him, keep judging his journey, keep talking about how he's gay, keep talking about how he ain't shit, you're gonna screw yourself. Because the twin the twins heal each other, the karmic don't. Okay. That's the difference. The karmic is hard to maintain. Although the karmic love is real as well and is passionate as well, but it's a lesson, okay, and a blessing. The twin heals. So when I hear tarot readers telling y'all not to connect or not to uh, sleep, whatever, let me tell you something. This is how I know y'all don't know your business. The twin energy heals. They don't want you to connect with your twin rate energy frequency. OK, you have to level up and to only level up on this journey. You got to get all that out your system, because the point is, these are costumes. These are bodies. And you're supposed to be able to look past until you are able to look past that body and all that crap he's done. Right. And know that he is a divine being. He's a divine one. That's what I call him. Right. Father will send somebody else in your place. OK. Right. Okay. And a lot of these readers are telling these masculines that the feminists got new love, and that's not true. Okay. I told you it's a plot twist in the game. Right? Okay, so for Taurus, yeah, your spiritual lessons are continuing to unfold. All right? Watch your thought patterns. Okay. I was talking crap last week. My father said, get off of it. Sure was. He said, get off of it. He sure did. Get off that Negro's neck. He sure did. I said, ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> Yes, he did. Shut my mouth real quick. Corrupt. Taurus, there's some corrupt energy going on. Yeah. Corruption. Okay. Stop sleeping on the first day. RIP that shit. Okay, that's my RIP card. Shouldn't even been in there. Somebody sleeping on the first date. RIP that shit. You're avoiding. 
Uh-huh. I know some people that does that. Vibration. Okay. Everything vibrates at different frequency. Your vibe is your own unique frequency or energy pattern. So when you guys try to copy other people's, everybody has their own unique frequency pattern. You, it's impossible. That's why when people start to say certain words, other people say, that's why it don't come out right. Sounds funny. Yeah. Everything vibrates at a different frequency. Your vibe is your own tribe. Your vibe is your own unique frequency or energy, Taurus. When you raise your vibe, you become invisible to low vibrations around you. Your vibrational state is what determines your way of life, influenced by your thought and beliefs, right? Observe your thoughts. Right? Okay, Taurus, you're finding your vibe. You got the, some Tauruses out there. It's in some, got some corrupt thoughts going on. You need an attitude adjustment, honey. Yes, you do. So you can create a position of strength on your journey, baby. Okay? Huh. Meditation and your battle warrior prayer, friend. Stop playing victim, right? And the more you do what? The more you deny the flesh, you get stronger spiritual. Your soul spiritually presence, spiritual baller gets stronger. The more you feed, give to your desires, your flesh. Okay? The more you give in to the desires of your flesh, Taurus. Okay? You deaf yourself to the spirit so you can't hear. Okay? So there's a Taurus that got a flesh problem. Right? 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 Okay. So you have... Hold on just a second, you guys. Hold on. All right, you guys. I was like, what this all the screaming about? There's a snake out there. Yeah, baby, it's getting for real. Yeah, rattlesnake season. Mm. Okay, so Taurus, and I know a Taurus that sleeps on the first date too old, and she still don't get it. I don't know why y'all don't get it. And you're looking for validation by sleeping with people. Okay, so this is why you got the uh, meditation and fast, and you need to put on your body warrior prayer. Okay, you're too critical and rigid. Right? Okay. What you vibe? Your vibe is taking a dive, Taurus. What's happening? Okay, last card. Your so okay, your soul is your will, body, and emotions. You are a spirit, but you have a soul in its flesh fighting to for control, will, and emotions. Okay? Let's talk about that. Let's talk about how we got out here that about the masculines being gay. That has nothing to do with their fucking soul. And I know this is a lot of it coming back up lately. So for you people, for you feminists, you need to be very careful. Because what's happening is the karmic readers are trying to tell you not to mess with the masculine. They're very clever. You know, they, tarot readers get things old. We keep re refreshing and refreshing. We, re we keep refreshing old dirt. We keep watering old dirt, recycling and regurgitating bullshit as far as I'm concerned. It's none of my business. Okay. If you continue to look on the outside, it's just like the first round, the process. If you continue to look on the outside, now you're going to miss the boat this time like he missed it. Right? Tables turn, Right? Right? So to break the power of the flesh is to deny it. So when flesh wants to look at porn, deny it. When it wants to drink, smoke, suck, deny it. Okay. So your spirit will start to control your thoughts and your decisions. Okay. Right? All right, Taurus. Okay. All right. Because there's no bodies in the kingdom of heaven. We are orbs. We are light beings. The dark ones are very, very, very good at what they do. Very clever. 
I got to give it to him, though. Very clever. Okay. So if you're looking at your masculine and you say, oh, no, I don't want him because he, he bisexual, he gay, you're going to lose. Quiet as is kept. The feminine energy, sexual energy, heals the masculine wounds. He won't even have a taste for that. And not only that, I'm going to give y'all another pop tip. Twins can change bodies as well. So we can be a female or we can be a male. We can be whatever we want. Pop tip. All right, then. Okay, let's keep it pushing. Okay? All righty, then. So, therefore, Taurus, I'm going to need you to uh, create a position of strength and observe the obvious in yourself. These are self-created demons. And at this point, your energy field is corrupt and you're playing victim. So you need to do a lot of meditation and integration, baby, and battle warrior prayer, okay? All right. Because right now, that's your vibration, right? Sleeping on the first day, you need to RP that shit, right? Okay? RP that. This is not our RIP day, but you need to RIP that shit. Okay? All right, my friend. Oh, girl, we need... I'm, no, afterwards, I'm going on uh, lipstick, honey. You know I love lipstick. If I don't do nothing else. My teeth get fresh. got to put on my lipstick. I don't know what it is. I got to put on my lipstick. Uh-huh. Okay, so let's go to Gemini. Let's see what Gemini... Refining your vibe. Yeah, this shit ain't easy. Hell nah. Shit ain't easy, honey. Mm -mm. Mm. I don't care what, how balanced you think you are. It's always going to be triggers and riggers. Okay? And that's the truth, Ruth. If I even say 